Hey YouTube, Gecko Guy here. So here I'm going to be showing you how to waterproof your own receiver. For this test model, we are using a Hobby King Orange RX receiver. These are basically bootleg Spectrum uh, receivers. And here I'm just using Quick Seal. It's a clear silicone. Um, you can use Plasti Dip. That's also what a lot of people use. I just like using silicone because I just like using it. Um, I'm not a fan of Plasti Dip, although it does work very well. Um, so here I am just showing you um, how I do it. I put a little blob of it on the bottom as well as on the top. I left the little contact points out and this should be pretty much water resistant, like splash proof. I shouldn't really have to worry about it. The only time I need to worry about it is if I'm submerging it. That's when I would probably want to um, goop, goop on some leads and stuff like that and my dad actually thought that this was his silicone which it's not it's mine <laughs> so we got into a little argument there while i do this uh, voiceover um so here i am just kind of putting it down um and as far as <clears throat> getting it back together you just gotta clip it back on uh for the little clips that it sits in and these things are dirt cheap i love them using I love using these ones over the $60 Spectrum receivers or even the $30 waterproof ones for that matter because they're just so darn cheap. $11 and just basically just uh, put it in a little blob of silicone and it's good to go for waterproofing. And if it breaks, oh well, at least you're only out like 11 bucks versus 60 and have to deal with shitty uh, Horizon Hobby customer service. Did Gecko Guy just say that? Yes, he actually did because he's had so much bad luck with them. But anyway, here is how I do it for receivers, and I do it as well as servos. And here I am just applying a little light bead around it, so it should be all set to go. Thanks for watching, guys. Come like, subscribe.